Right, so let's move on to this next match. Loser semis between Odyssey and Zane. Oh, and this is the run back because uh, uh, before Adi beat him 3-0 with the Fox, Fox, Cloud. Yeah, so this is definitely like his time to like. So um, definitely, you know, you know, unfortunate stuff. But let's see if Zane can bring it back. You know, so, you know, sometimes in this game, stuff like that happens. Yeah. So. Good Thank right. you, Devin, for the clapping. By yeah, the way. and he already tacked. And that. you know, he already tacked on seventy-six percent. He only took twenty-six percent. So, you know, he, 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 could, he could bring it back. Look at that, nice back air. You're trying to take that stock pretty quick. Mm. Yeah, but like, oh, my, oh, that down tilt. I always say this thing is about um Fox's tilts. Fox's tilts could set, pretty much set up for kills, follow-ups, no matter which one you throw out, whether it be tech chase follow-ups. It's just, Fox is just crazy, man. Yeah, Fox has a lot of just pressure. He just throw out his opponent, you know? You holding that shield? I'm gonna throw some back airs against you. Drags him down. I thought he was gonna get that tech read. He went to like an up smash, but it wouldn't have killed. Actually, he might have. You know, Fox had 100. That almost killed. 20 rage. Good tech. Still living another great oh, wow. tech. Audi living the dream. Oh, you died now. Yeah, he. There was no way because he re grabbed the ledge, so he wouldn't get invincibility, which is why he held down to go through the ledge, yeah, try hoping to, to just try to hit Zane. Yeah, at least clip him. Yeah. But I mean, good stuff by Zane. You know, he got all pretty much all those tech follow-ups. So you know, Zane at 89%. You no, know, bought it back somewhat from that. You know, unfortunate SD earlier. Saw him holding that shield. Not want to commit to that jump that Odyssey was trying to fish for. Yeah, and right now uh, Odyssey is you know just trying to find find a way to get down, and he just he just comes down with down here and grabs him. Yeah, I mean it works. Ooh, yeah, Bayo's okay. So Bayo's ledge roll is actually pretty bad. Hmm. That's the one like terrible thing about this character. It's reactable. Her ledge roll is reactable, and you get like really easy punishes off it. That's why a lot of Bayo's usually just like ABK or at least standard get up or jump from ledge. They almost never go for it unless they're really trying to hard mix up their opponent. Which I think is what Zane was trying to do. Sometimes when uh, something that Fox can do especially is put enough pressure on their opponent to just like go for like you think you can't push certain buttons so then you try the buttons that are not safe like the ledge roll. Yeah, just tried to like the hard mix them up and didn't, I mean, didn't work out for him so Game one going to Odyssey. All right, here we go. Game number two, though. Let's see if Zane can try to bring this back. Immediately tries to start that off with an up smash. Yeah, it looked like he was trying to just double up here and probably got stuck in his movement. That, that was, was on purpose. slick. That's really, like, unsafe to go for, too, because there's a chance that, like, Zane could potentially go for a like, witch time. But... Yeah. yeah, in that situation, though, um, Light does this also. Light, I, this is the first, I asked Light the first person I seen do this. So what happens is when sometimes when you put, put opponents in situations, right, and you know they're just going to mash, you just up smash them, you know, just to check their mash. And another SD by Zane. Yeah, but kind of shocking. I mean, something's not working out for Zane, but as I say that, which twist, jab, forward air? Yo, I was pretty uncharacteristic, and that, that's like- And he just took the lead! Yeah, that's the Zane, you know, I'm, I'm used to seeing. Yeah. Okay, Wait, time. Because of which time pushed him back a little bit, didn't allow uh, Odyssey to be able to land that grab. Yeah, and um, also, Bale also has like invulnerability frames, so I was like, you can't really grab her. For like, what, like two frames? Or something, right? it, it, it's something. Oh, bat within gonna be able to allow him to get the witch twist out of there. Yeah, up to oh that up to hitbox. Man. Yeah, it goes pretty far. Respect those pistols. Yeah, and good empty land, empty land and grab by Zane. Wow, got quick thirty percent off of that, and he keeps rolling onto to ledge like that, man. I don't know about that. Oh, this could be big. Up smash yep, that is died. game. Zane after SDing yet again. Brings it back, game number two, yeah, taking man. the first game off of Audi since winners. Yeah, Zayn locked in, man. Like, I just think after SD, he was just over it, man. He's just like, you know what? I'm done. Now, Audi could potentially switch back to Cloud after this. I was talking to Audi later on about why he keeps going to Cloud randomly. Mm -hmm. And he says it's because he wants to pick him up as a secondary, so he's throwing him out in matchups that he doesn't feel as comfortable with okay. Fox. But right now, I think he wants to keep his Fox warmed up when he fights off against... Uh, Utopian Ray in the next set if he wins. Yeah, and you know, I, and I can see why um, he could see this as a matchup that he might be too not too uncomfortable in. Because like, just like you saw, 
Fail could just make Fox explode sometimes. Yeah. And he can make Fox afraid of pressing buttons, and that's what Fox love to do is press a lot of buttons. They, they, like, if you can't, if, if you make them not be able to do what they want to do, then you're at the advantage, you know? Yeah. There you go, catches him with the forward air. That was the longest slide. I remember man, Fox was just, like moonwalking out there. Yeah, and then with that, and then he got hit with the slide, and then he just slid himself, like slid himself. Like. Mm -hmm. Slip and slide. That Ooh. smash. Yo, that, yo, that slide off ABK is just. All right, good tech from Zane, escaping any sort of a uh, follow up from uh, Adi. Once the back air on the Fox illusion, gonna go for the witch twist as shield. And then do the auto cancel down there, so it was definitely a lot of. Energy. Okay. Yeah, I mean. You know, good punish by uh, Odyssey because that's not safe on Shield, really. And uh, Zayn didn't even throw out the kick afterwards, so. Oh, uh, we got that tilt lock. That wasn't true. No. <laughs> you know, Zayn was definitely just spamming which twist to try to get escape that scenario. There, he's out of stage with no jumps. Oh, oh Zayn yeah. mistimed the back air. Yeah, mistimed the back air. He had to like recover safe, so he wouldn't have enough jumps to get back. So. Good punish from Adi, punishing the witch twist. Oh, couldn't get the turnaround for the grab. He's gonna go for the double ABK, sends him up to the top, 135%. Neutral out of shield, good stuff. Oh, yeah, nice reaction. Like, calling that jump out with him there. Like, jump at me again. Now Zane's still in this. He got 72%. I mean, it's starting to grow a little larger, but. Yeah, but, like, but we saw in game two, like, Zane just took that stock at high percent. Yeah. didn't even care. I mean, that's the power of Witch Time. Yeah, that, yeah. Ozzy's been doing that a lot at the ledge, just like empty landing because the people are in shield waiting for the back air. And he needs to stop rolling a ledge like that. I feel that's the second time that Zane's actually done a ledge roll to at the end of the game. Yeah, but even in the middle of the game, he's been getting a punished a lot off of ledge roll. Mm -hmm. I think every single time he ledge roll, he got punished. I don't think it worked once. It might just be like a crutch for him where like he's used to pushing R on the ledge with other characters and he feels a little bit safer. I don't know. Or I don't know, man. Usually I don't see Zane roll a lot because mm. I know he specifically told me that move is horrendous. Yeah. <laughs> but that. I'm wondering like if it's because like he's finding he's getting so pressured that he's reverting back to old bad habits, you know? That's maybe. something that could happen. Or maybe he's just going for too many mix ups in his head. Yeah. <laughs> he's thinking too hard and he's yeah. just like, wait, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah. I mean, but right now, I mean, we have run wanna try a platform dream one. And I, and I can see this working out for Zane. Yeah. I mean, you can't escape that. These follow-ups from Adi, my god. That, and that down there follow-up, man. So, Adi found his steam. He's just, uh, just tagging on Ooh. hit after hit against Zane. And then that tech chase. Got the trump afterwards, too. Just runs up, raw up smash. Yeah, it caught his roll away. Again? Yeah, and he just, he just called out his landing. And that's why, like... Against characters like Fox and Greninja, or like characters that just like put you in the air a lot, sometimes it's, it's just there. You have to save them. Yeah, I think he saved them. Yeah, it, it definitely. Well, I mean, you save him to kill him. I guess know. he's gonna live though. Oh, he didn't charge him. Though. Um, it's just wise to reset the lead sometimes though. I, what? Again? Okay. Yeah. Stop pressing buttons. <laughs> yeah. Audi was definitely kept lighting down with neutral air. If at first it doesn't succeed, try try again, I guess. Ooh. 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 I thought he was going to get that tech, that tech mm -hmm. roll. I, I felt it in my bones. Okay. Yeah, he's, yeah that's, he's just checking his mash down. Like, he's mashing Nair downwards, and Adi, Adi already knows that. Up air. Yeah, tip her up air, man. Adi just buying some time in the air with a reflector. Yo, you're crazy for that. Yeah, like, that, that, honestly, that, that, against Bayo, like... <laughs> that's how you die. <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to buy time. See, again, he did it again, and he put himself in a really bad spot. Oh. Down air? Oh, that was untechable, too. Yeah, he an untechable part of the stage. Oh, yeah. Now he's out of jumps. Now, now it's just rinse and repeat. And that is game. Yeah, man. And it's like, all because Adi he, got ahead of himself. He went for that forward air twice. And it's like, after the first time, I thought to myself, okay. You no, know, he went for it first. Okay, I understand. Go for that read, mm -hmm. right? And he went for it again and just put himself in this long, just rinse and repeat option. And there was no reason for him to actually go for that because he was at pretty okay percent against yeah. Bayo. Like, he wasn't winning, but it wasn't that big of a deficit. So he risked it all, and now he's going to game five. At least he's playing on his home turf. Yeah, sometimes, yeah. I mean, sometimes you just want to end it, so... Mm -hmm.
Let's move on to the next game. Game number five, Zane might get this run back against Audi, man. And you know what? I'm I'm pretty surprised that we haven't seen the cloud. Because it's cloud. He actually 2 owned him with this cloud. Yeah. So like, it, it was I'm actually shocked about that too, because yeah, he was not even like it wasn't even a match. Yeah, it's got, the cloud was looking pretty good, so maybe he's just, you know, feeling his box right now. His box has been gaining a lot of steam. Mm. And like you know, with that being said, Yoga has 63% on Zane. 77. And it can't even be a thing of like wanting to keep your Fox warmed up for the next set because I feel like Cloud would be really good against Rosalina, you know? Yeah. Ooh. There we go. Okay. And he yeah, is. Man. Uh, he's cooking. Yeah, he's cooking right now, man. But you know, Adi's gotten the first shock every single game, so who knows what can happen? Yeah. Especially if Odyssey goes running off stage, like you almost yeah. did just then. Like Zane wants him to. I feel like that's why Zane's kind of playing the ledge a little bit more. Yeah, I think he's, he's trying like, to bait him. Yeah, he's like, come on, just run off, and you know you want to run off. And there's just like the Fox McCloud inside of Adi that's just like, I'm gonna go for it. Hey! <laughs> Can't stop, won't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. Go back for it. Okay, Adi's uh, back center I mean, stage. Already lapped him in percent. Okay, I guess he's, he's expecting a Fox illusion. That's why I went for that witch time. Yeah, and I guess um, Odyssey's just reading that tech in place. That could have. Mm. Okay. Witch twist. Ooh. Trying to get that down air. Again, reset. That could be an up air. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah. Zane he bringing took, it back. Bro, he took him around the world. <laughs> what? He's like, here's the stage. Here's the sky. Here's the stage again. Okay, okay, okay. Wait. Okay. Zane almost okay. stole this from Adi. Wait, what is going on? Yeah, look, that's like I said, man. Zane should not be counted out, man. He's another one who could gain a lot of. St Game. <sighs> man. Uh, I mean, let's look at this conversion really quick. Yeah. Up salt, up air. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's true. <laughs> that was actually Saul, true. That was actually completely true. Saul yeah. Zane just like. Are you like? Are you kidding me? 